doing a video that is related to tech yes i am doing a video about a gadget and what i have on my hand is a p40 light as i've already uh, told you earlier on i really do love the color i'm really loving what they did with the mashup of this light blue and this light purple i don't, I don't know what it's called however i really do like what they did here it just meshes up nicely and you cannot see a clear distinction as to where the blue ends and where the purple ends so i really 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 like what they did with that and i like how that uh, for uh, that quad camera notch uh, that quad camera bump kind of stands out um it pretty much gives you a, a premium feeling when you're holding it however as you know it's made out of plastics it's not uh, it's not it's not metal or 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 aluminium or anything like that on the sides as fleshy as it looks but it's not what it looks like i know it looks like uh, that fleshiness you'd find on an iphone say an iphone 10 11 or 12 however no not this not this time around you're gonna find plastics uh the price also says it like the phone is not that expensive i mean it's about six six, six grand brand new uh, in south africa so that's six thousand rands and a six thousand six point five not over seven grand and real and, and and these days that's not that much of an expensive phone that's a medium entry level uh smartphone even the features on this phone if i'd be really really honest the features on this phone are high end because it's got a face unlock you can see that it's got a fingerprint sensor it's got a face id now what they did with the fingerprint sensor it's not on the screen or in the back like how they usually do on the previous models um they mounted it here on the side on the unlock button where you always rest your finger to unlock your phone which is pretty nice and slick i like it now to go back and forward i like to use gestures like uh, instead of using these buttons that used to these ghost buttons that used to be on the bottom section here on your phone I like to use but uh, i like to use gestures almost like that on an iphone 12 uh, when i want to go home just swipe up when i want to go to my recent tab swipe halfway shows you your recent tabs when you want to go back for example go back one step just slide from any side can it can be this side or from this side that's that that's the benefits that's how it gets better than ios over here with the gestures i like it very much and i like what they did with the emui um skin you do know that it doesn't have android and uh, trust me i do know a way to get around this because uh, I've been using Huawei ever since, uh, ever since, if, if, like, even, even, what, what year was this, 20, 2020 or 2019 when the band started? Yeah, I never stopped using Huawei and I figured out a way to actually get around the Google services band. So I know how to get your Google services and everything. The design is amazing. If we can go back to that. But moving on further, I did say it's got a 128 gigabyte internal memory, uh, which is very amazing. Um, because I got a, I got a, I got a, I got a Samsung J3, which has eight gigabytes of the total storage of the phone. No kidding, and that's just like almost the RAM of this one, because this has six gigs of RAM. So if you see properly, you can see that this phone has. 128 gb internal memory however they do not give you an option to put uh, an sd card so yeah that's one downer about this phone it's got a 6.4 inch screen it's got a 48 megapixel camera there is an app called dual space so what you need to do to get this very easy um just go to youtube search youtube uh once you are on youtube now you need to search how to get google services on huawei 
yeah just say this and then this is the first video that's going to pop up i don't know where you are around the globe or but this is the video that always pops up if i use this precise keywords how to get google services on huawei so this video on what gear watch yeah. yoga videos are free and, and, and uh, big up to what it's doing. It's doing a very, very, it's doing, it's doing a very, very great job. It's it's gotten about over it's gotten over a million views in a year's time. But what you need to do when you here, just click, click on the drop down button over there. You see that drop down button. Now here's a link to download the actual jewel space that's gonna give you access to Google services now you click that link it takes you straight uh, to his website once you're there there's a button there's a simple button to download don't worry about the other buttons download jewel space apk close this ad it says download yes i downloaded it's added it added oh there's it coming through it's downloaded now once that's downloaded it's gonna give you access to google services don't download any tools uh jewel space go to that uh, link that specific link i'll try to put it on my uh, on my channel if there won't be any copyright strikes for that now open the jewel space and when you get there you'll, you'll be surprised that uh, it's showing you the first thing you find is google play now it's showing you how to actually work it but i know all the steps i think i can just skip it now i go in here now it's loading google services you see literally downloading google services <laughs> oh shit yeah so it's downloading Google services. This phone actually belongs to a customer of mine. He bought it, he paid for it. So I need to send it to him. I'm making things very easy to him right now. Very easy for him because now he's got Play Store. Now to show you that I'm not even kidding, I go into this Play Store and I'll download an app for you. I'll download, what app should I? Oh, it needs me to sign in, but I'm too lazy to sign in actually but yes once you are there you are done you can sign in with your google account and download any app you want even if it's a google app you can get google drive google uh, mail which is gmail anything will work uh, and excuse me for this angle for being so for, for just placing the phone like this is because i don't have uh, enough equipment excuse me for that uh it's a flaw on my part I did want to speak about jewel space and yes I've already spoken about jewel space also want to say that Huawei is still very uh, very very relevant to this date no matter what they did with the band I mean look at the Huawei Nova Nova 8i Nova uh, Nova 8 um, look at the Huawei P50 uh, look at that, uh, that 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 large dual camera setup with uh, with three three lenses at the top and I think two on the bottom, and I think uh, Xiaomi Xiaomi has already copied that uh, that that style, not really copied but they've been influenced by it as well because I do see some night uh, some Redmi devices uh, with that camera bump and I think it actually debuted on Huawei. Now I can't wait to actually have a first-hand experience with Harmony OS because they say it basically looks like Android and it feels like Android. So now Huawei is actually rolling out phones without Android at all, without sorry, without Google at all. Excuse me for that. Um, they say Harmony Harmony OS works exactly like android and uh, uh i believe it because i've seen how those 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 phones look actually i couldn't spot any difference from the 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 the, the usual huawei's and the new ones uh software wise it is still running on uh, the android's uh android main uh main main what's this main 
main skin because obviously android is open source so they can still use this they can still use it it's running it's running android 10 and i like these little games they do with this android you know you can actually just play a few games on your board put the one here put the android here put like you know just some yeah some childish things some childish vibes here anyways moving on further uh I'm just gonna wrap this video i think i've said pretty much everything that i can say about this phone it does have a loud speaker a very loud speaker get the picture um very very loud picture uh sorry i said picture what speaker yeah so yeah it's gonna be a wrap for this phone i think i'm forgetting something but i think oh yes i remembered what it is unlike premium smartphones we still get a 3.5 millimeter check uh, uh millimeter check for our for our earphones i mean of course not everybody can afford wireless earphones but i totally understand the motion behind the wireless earphones and i did tell you that the fingerprint is mounted on the side and i also showed you a way to get uh, your google services on uh on a huawei and then you can just create shortcuts of this of these apps you see there's even youtube over there uh now here's a Where's the Play Store shortcut that I just made? The shortcut has been added successfully. Okay, I don't see where the shortcut is. But yeah, you, you do get the picture. Uh, your, 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 your Play Store is still, is still working. Whenever you click on it, just sign in and you can download any apps right from there and if you have any questions about this dual space thingy just let me know in the comments down below and i'll be more than happy to answer them it has been a fun one from to seek at gadget berry you guys have yourselves a great day because i'm definitely going to be having myself a good one here peace